Cherry harvest is a busy time of the year. There are many things that have to be done, quickly and with care, to ensure the crop is picked and delivered to market in the best possible condition. Among fruit crops that you may work with, cherries are very delicate and are easily damaged. Unfortunately, much of this damage doesn't show up until after the cherries reach the marketplace. So it's difficult to know if they were picked correctly until it's too late. Fruit damaged during harvest becomes bruised or pitted by the time it reaches the marketplace. These defects make cherries less appealing to shoppers, reduce sales, and reflect badly on the grower. However, careful handling by workers during all phases of cherry harvest, including picking, dumping into bins or boxes, moving the fruit within the orchard, or transporting it to the packing house, can ensure the best possible quality is maintained all the way from the tree to the market. People are easily injured too. That's why your employer wants you to stay healthy and safe while doing your job. This videotape is a reminder of the many things you should already know about handling cherries and about staying safe, especially during the hectic pace of cherry harvest. Before using your ladder, carefully check it to make sure it's in good condition. If your ladder has any missing, loose, weak, or broken rungs, or defective side rails, point these out to your supervisor and ask for a ladder that does not have these defects. When you set the ladder, make sure it's straight and firm. Also remember, others will need to get around it, even when you're working on it. Do not climb a ladder if you have mud or grease on your shoes and always test the ladder's position in the tree before climbing it. Do not try to balance, adjust, or move the ladder while you're on it. At all times, keep your balance. And do not attempt to pick fruit that is out of your reach. Supporting the ladder on tree branches is not recommended. If you must, do so only with the permission of your supervisor and be sure the ladder is leaning against a strong, flat branch. Never climb onto the tree. Both you and the tree can be injured if a branch breaks. Face the ladder when you climb it, as well as when you come down. Also, orchard ladders should be long enough so you never have to climb past the top three steps. Pick cherries only by their stems. Do this by placing your fingers on the stem, not the fruit, and pulling or gently twisting back toward the tree or branch. Carelessly stripping the fruit from the tree will bruise it, remove stems, and damage the spurs. Also avoid squeezing the fruit, since it bruises easily. A worker who is picking a lot of stemless fruit is probably pulling on the fruit, which is incorrect. Always pick cherries by their stems. Stemless fruit cannot be marketed and has to be thrown away. And damaged spurs reduce the tree's ability to produce fruit next year. When placing fruit into the bucket, drop it the shortest distance possible by keeping your bucket close to the branch you're picking from. This is very important when your bucket is empty because fruit can be severely bruised as it hits the bottom of the bucket, especially when dropped from a great distance. Your supervisor may ask you to use a foam pad in the bottom of the bucket to reduce this kind of damage. Even with fruit already in the bucket, be careful, since the fruit can be damaged when dropped onto other cherries or their stems, even from a very short distance. When dumping fruit from your picking bucket into the boxes or bins, slowly roll the fruit out. Never dump fruit in a rough manner. Always handle it softly and delicately. Touch the fruit as little as possible after dumping. Pushing the fruit around in a box or bin to level it or pick out leaves also damages it and should not be done. Instead, remove the leaves from your picking bucket as you go. Keep bins or boxes of picked fruit in the shade or covered. 
fruit left in the sun, even for a short time, gets warm very fast and rapidly deteriorates. Workers, using equipment to move boxes or bins of fruit around the orchard or to load fruit onto trucks for transport, also need to handle it very carefully. Be extremely alert when operating tractors, forklifts, and other machinery in areas where other people are working. Do not permit riders on the tractor or on equipment being pulled by a tractor. Fruit being hauled to the packing house should be tightly secured to the truck. Cover the top layer of bins or boxes, even for short trips, to keep fruit as cool as possible. Choose smooth, direct routes for rapid but gentle trips. If you are hauling, drive carefully for both the safety of other workers and to prevent the fruit from bouncing around in bins or boxes. Whether driving in the orchard or on the public roadway, observe all traffic and motor vehicle regulations. Careful attention during all phases of harvest, safe use of ladders, proper picking and handling, and careful transport of fruit to the packing house will help ensure a safe and productive harvest. Thank you.